friends now let us discuss about positive clamper with a level shifter so here in this circuit we have a voltage source also so this dc supply is there as well as uh, su supply signal and capacitor and diode is connected now in this circuit we have when you are analyzing the steps we are following is the first step is when the diode is conducting see the maximum voltage to which the capacitor will get charged so here so if you observe the according to the polarity of the circuit the, the diode is conducting so here at positive potential we have minus e so at negative potential it should be less than minus e so diode it will be on when the vi input is less than minus e so if you see the signal so this is a sine solid waveform so when your input goes below minus e less than minus e then the diode will conduct so when the diode is so during this part the diode will conduct when the diode is conducting in the negative peak is minus vm so here the in maximum input voltage you are going to apply is minus vm so at this point we have to calculate the vc so at this point so when the diode is conducting i will consider the loop equation here so let us take this is vc and this is vi so if you take a loop equation like this so vi input voltage minus vc plus e equal to 0 this is when diode is conducting so during this part vc will be equal to vc is equal to so vi plus e but what is the what is the maximum input due when the diode is conducting here the maximum input is minus v the here the peak value is minus vm so when you substitute this value so minus vm plus e that is the that is the capacitance voltage across this so the peak voltage you are going to get across the capacitor now the second step is we have to calculate the output because from the next clock cycle next uh, from the from the next period onwards the diode will be open when the diode is open so we have to see the output so this will be equal to when this is open you will take only vi minus vc minus v0 equal to 0 from this v0 is equal to when you take vi minus vc but here already we got vc value as minus vm plus e so vi minus uh, minus of this one so this is plus vm minus e this is the output voltage so this is the relation for between input and output so v0 is equal to vi plus vm minus e so let us consider when input is zero so because this is sine solid waveform when input is zero then output is equal to vm minus e so if you take this is the vm so maybe at this point we will have vm minus e so when your input is zero it will start at this point now when input is maximum peak so when input is vm so when input is vm it will go to 2 vm minus e let us take this is 2 vm minus e so it will reach this peak point again when input is zero it will come to this place again when input is minus vm so when you take negative peak so when any input is minus vm it will go to minus e like this again it will come to this place again it will go here so this output waveform will look like this this is how the output waveform will be so here it is again the dc value is changed to vm minus v the minus e so by changing the value of e here if you take e is equal to 0 then this will be vm as we discussed suppose if you take this e is equal to 0 this is same as the previous circuit we discussed suppose here by changing the value of e we can shift the dc level of this voltage this waveform so this is the positive clipper with a level shifter